Chapter 14 The Invisible Man Theme Science Fiction Kickstart If you were given the power to become invisible, how would you use it? The Invisible Man is about a scientist who discovers a way to become invisible. Initially excited about a life free of rules, he quickly realizes the difficulties of being invisible. This passage describes his first experience of venturing into the crowded streets of London as an invisible man. In Oxford Street In going downstairs the first time, I found an unexpected difficulty because I could not see my feet. I stumbled twice and there was an unaccustomed clumsiness in gripping the bolt. By not looking down, however, I managed to walk on the level passably well. My mood, I say, was one of exaltation. I felt as a seeing man might do, with padded feet and noiseless clothes in a city of the blind. I experience a wild impulse to jest, to startle people, to clap men on the back, fling people's hats astray and generally revel in my extraordinary advantage. But hardly had I emerged upon Great Portland Street when I heard a clashing noise and was hit violently behind, and turning, saw a man carrying a basket of soda water siphons and looking in amazement at his burden. Although the blow had really hurt me, I found something so irresistible in his astonishment that I laughed aloud. The devil is in the basket, I said, and twisted it out of his hand. He let go of it and swung the whole weight into the air. But a fool of a cabman standing outside a public house made a sudden rush for it, and his extended hand hit me under the ear painfully. I let the basket down with a smash on the cabman.